Hello everyone, this is Eat Sleep here from the Techies, and uh, today's tutorial is going to be a little longer than most, so bear with me. Uh, I'm going to be showing you how to create a template that you can start creating websites. Uh, this is all HTML, by the way. Uh, I'm also going to be using PS Pad, which is just a free program where you can uh, build websites in it. Very simple to use, great program. So I'm going to go ahead and get started right off the bat here and make an HTML and body tag. And uh, now I'm going to create a title, just a title tag, and name it template uh, one, and end that title tag, and the head tag. You guys should know all of this. If not, then go check out my basic tutorials which will have all of this gone over so I'm gonna throw also just throw in a quick CSS thing here I'm gonna do body style and I want it to be uh, body style the background color it's gonna be white So we have to end it and delete one of those and close the tag. Now we can actually actually start with the table, and the table is just like any other table you would do. It would be table border, and I'm gonna make this one three. So table border three. I want width. Uh, I want it to be 100%, and I want the height also to be 100%, so it takes up the whole page. I'm also going to add a cell padding, which is just um, how far spaced, how much padding is on the sides or the ends around the table itself. And I want zero, and I also want a cell spacing, which is the space between the cells. I'll also put that at zero, just for ease, I guess, if you will. So now what we have to do is we have to create the three main kind of cells that are in this table. So I'm going to start with a table row to get started, and I'm going to throw in this uh, kind of really weird looking if you haven't seen before this is xhtml uh i guess uh tables but it's relatively the same it's just an easier way to organize things so we want row one cell one which is the very top of it and this one's gonna be the border and we just end that like so um, since this is the top, I want this to span across all the tables, and I already know I'm only going to have two underneath, so I want to, I have to make a column span, so td call span, and it's going to span across two. So we have that, and the height is going to be, uh, we're going to make it, I guess... 20% sounds good. And we can end that, and I'm just going to add a little note saying uh, top bar for header. Now we're going to just TD and TD it so we can create our next uh, row, which is the row under it. So let me just quickly do that. And um, I don't really want to type all this again and I'm sure you don't either so just uh, you can just copy and paste and we can edit that code now uh, this is gonna be row 2 still cell 1 and it's gonna be called nav for the navigation so what I'm gonna do here is delete this column span because we don't need it and I'm going to add a a little CSS, I guess, 
what I'm going to do is I'm going to make the nav bar a class type so you can go back later and edit this so class make it nav and I want the width to be 15, 20 width, uh, I'll go with 20 on this so width is 20 and the height I want it to be 80 because we subtract the uh, border or the header on the top minus 100 which would be 80 so now I'm gonna uh, create a quick paragraph to just say uh, navigation bar or menu or whatever so we're done with that and I'll end it to table down and all we have to do for this last one is, since it's in the same row, we don't have to add table row tags. So, once again, I'm just going to copy it down because I'm lazy. Yes, so uh, we'll delete the nav, td class, we don't need that. We want to add a td width. Uh, the width will be 80%, height will be 80%, this will be cell 2. We'll call this one body. Body. The body where all the good stuff goes, the content of your site. Pretty cool. And, um, throw in another, uh, little note here that says body has content. And, uh, pretty much we're done now, so unless you want to have more columns, which is, would be cool, but, you know very easy to edit this kind of stuff do very whatever you want so table row we need a table end tag too many end tags body and the last html so now i'm gonna save as a htm so just template dot htm so yay, here it is. And if we click on it and open it, we have our kind of little template thing we have here. We have the header, navigation, and the body part of the page. And so, thanks for watching.